Lucas Raymond is ranked sixth overall by Craig Button in November's rankings, and you can see why. But how about this playmaking ability? Remember, he's only 17 years old. He's draft eligible. The vision, the awareness. Not very often we want to highlight a 17-year-old. Well, when you're as good as Lucas Raymond, you deserve to be highlighted. Here's Raymond back the other way for Sweden. Lucas Raymond. Works his way in. Oh. What a move! He whistled that wide. Wow, that was slick. Look at this dangle <laughs> around New Zealand. Oh, just gorgeous work by Raymond. Lucas Raymond is not only very gifted, but he's very sharp and very astute. The hockey sense, the awareness of what his options are and how to execute. Very, very talented. And keep in mind, he was out for about six weeks prior to the tournament. So trying to find his legs, trying to find his confidence in a high, high-end, best-on-best tournament. Raymond scores! And he rips this one to the far side. Lucas Raymond steps right into it, shoots it between the legs of Guggenheim, and Charlene just can't pick it up on the inside of the post. Norlander back for Lucas Raymond, eligible for this summer's draft. Raymond. Tries to work it out of the corner, gets the check of the chaper off. Soderstrom, nice little toe drag, and then a wrister that got blocked. And Lucas Raymond in with some physicality on Ola Koiko. Really tricky to evaluate 17-year-old players against 19-year-olds in this tournament. There aren't many 17-year-olds who have dominated. There's Raymond with it. Lucas Raymond works right in. He's taken down, and a penalty coming to the checks as Lucas Raymond has a great chance in front. Great puck work, stick handling ability, and tight from Lucas Raymond. He's tripped up right at the tail end of that play. Raymond trying to track it down, got some help. Hendrickson will play it back to Kinney. Back into the slot for Raymond. Delay scores, and the beneficiary of a terrific play by 17 years. Lucas Raymond. Lucas Raymond takes it off the left wing boards, and once he sees the opening into the middle of the ice, he attacks the net. And then a perfect pass to Carl Hendrickson. Remember Soap on a rope? We're going to see skill on a rope, and the Swedes are able to handle that puck and make plays because of that high-end skill. And, you know, the way they, they do it with speed, they do it in tight areas, and they're always ready to make a play to the next player where that player has an advantage, and now he can show off his skill and finish a play. You know, when I watch Lucas Raymond and I watch Alexander Holtz play, you know, if you're going to play in the National Hockey League, you have to be comfortable playing in traffic and playing with opponents on your hip and close to you and be comfortable attacking into the middle of the ice. Both those players do that exceptionally well, and that translates to the National Hockey League. Taken wide by Lucas Raymond. Soderstrom and back for Raymond. Raymond playing cross ice. Good stick by Yendik to break it up. And then a quick shot save made by Halabai. Raymond for Soderstrom. Soderstrom through traffic looking for a tip in front but unable to do so. Across for Raymond. Raymond will lead for Hendrickson. Back in front of the net for Raymond and he ripped that one wide. A good look for Raymond. Raymond with the block as it came up the boards. Pass back to Soderstrom. Works it across to Raymond. Centering pass and a great chance there for Fasic. Keeps it across for Holson. Oh, that went right through the goaltender. And then didn't make the stop, but the puck went wide. Sometimes you just can't believe the puck doesn't go into the net. You're standing there, you look at the net, the net looks so big, the puck looks so small, and then goes through his legs and wide of the net to the far side. This is going to be a great look at it. Somehow that doesn't go in the net. Alexander Holtz. Down for Lucas Raymond. Raymond back in front of the net. Trying to get a stick on that. And a chance in front was facing. Power play is over. And now another penalty shot score. Lucas Raymond is really strong on the puck. Gets it back to Soderstrom. Holtz gets himself open. What a great puck battle by Lucas Raymond. Holtz plays it cross ice for Raymond. Back up top, Soderstrom, and back down for Raymond. They play catch on the far side. Raymond finds Alexander Holtz. He'll take that return pass from Soderstrom and then give it back to him. And across for Raymond. Raymond tees it up. 
Holenstein the save and the rebound, sliding to break it up with Lucas on it. And Pelos gets stripped of the puck by Lucas Raymond. On for Holtz, back for Beargren. Beargren gets it back for Raymond, and the puck got rolling and bouncing, and bounces over a stick on the one-timer attempt. Raymond takes a look, sends it back. Save made. You know, all of you only had one World Series championship. Centered in front, deflected away. Bujalski chops it away, but can't clear the zone. Beargren gets knocked down on the play by Sleichkoff. Sleichkoff sends it around, but it gets blocked on the far side. Lucas Raymond into the slot. Shot by Pacek, got stuck. Comes back at the line. Plays it for Lucas Raymond. Back up top for Soderstrom. Winds it up, but hit a body in front. May have gone off Pacek. Their prospects and potential first round draft picks. The centering pass to Holtz, and Holtz couldn't pull the trigger. Hendrickson trying to get that for Holtz on it is Raymond. Back for Holtz, and he put that one right off the crossbar, maybe off the glove of Nurek first. Alexander Holtz, who had that overtime winner in game one against Finland. The 17-year-old plays it for Raymond. Pass by Hendrickson is intercepted and there. Holtz will carry it back. And good hustle to get back there by Lucas Raymond, the 17-year-old. Sandine on it again with Erholtz after him. Erholtz steals it centered. And a short side try there by Sorella. Another good defensive play by Raymond to intercept it. Sorella gets bumped in the corner boards by Raymond. Just will shovel this ahead. Nine to go here in the third period. In for Raymond. Lucas Raymond trying to snap that in on net. Ashukanov got a stick in the way. After it, Hendrickson. Centers in and front score. Lucas Raymond down to one knee because it was in tight and puts it up into the top part of the net. But but he gets down to one knee to try to get that leverage and to make sure that his hands are in a really good position. And just another example of the skill and the understanding of what you have to do. He is such a smart player and he anticipates plays. He reminds me in terms of his style of game and his heady style of game of Mitch Marner of the Toronto Maple Leafs. And, you know, we know that Mitch Marner's a real top-end NHL player, but the type of player, I say. I'm not going to tell you he's going to be Mitch Marner, because if he is, that's, but he's that type of player. He plays in for Lunda and will be a first-round pick come the draft this June. Lucas Raymond, we just saw a glimpse of him. I, if you can believe this, Dennis, Sweden had never won the under-18 championship. Never. But in April 2019, that all ended on home ice. Raymond on the short side, jamming at it, Nurek down. And we'll get another face off, and some of the Kazakhstan players taking exception to the fact that Lucas Raymond had a stick into the pads of their netbinder. Two youngsters that are going to be a big part of Sweden's international future, and certainly when they're drafted. Pretty high in the NHL draft come June 2020, part of the NHL team's future as well. And we're seeing 18-year-olds make the jump to the National Hockey League more than we used to. I don't think those two guys are ready coming out of their 18-year-old season. I love the little interplay here between Raymond and Holtz, and they understand each other like good offensive players do, where a player is, where he's headed to, we can't have eight players in the top five for the draft, but it seems like it. Holtz and Raymond are going to be in the conversation as well before it's all said and done. We mentioned, though, that Raymond playing in Forlunda doesn't get nearly the ice time, the power play time that others might. And now a hard shot by Raymond goes off the stick of Zabransky up and out of play. And that's what the scouts have to try to determine and why these tournaments become so important for the players that aren't playing a lot during the regular season. They've got to try and look at them now, project them forward, try and figure out where do you want to take them. Anderson tops, Raymond in, handle the shot. The other level of that misconduct yesterday that I just couldn't believe is the penalty was ending after the period. Nobody was coming out anyway. 
I, I just found the whole thing just utterly ridiculous. I hope they do change it. Raymond works free in the slot. Lucas Raymond spins and shoots. That's blocked as a hero for the Swedes in the 2019 I. IHF under 18 turned to be the hat trick in the whole medal game against the Russians, including the overtime winner. It was also terrific at the Holinka Gretzky Cup under 18 tournament in Edmonton in 2018. In for Raymond. Raymond ducking the check from Mosier and plays it back for Holtz. Holtz into the slot for Raymond. Raymond from the backhand to the forehand, and then it just got off the end of his stick before he could shoot it. Henriksen plays that back to Raymond. Lucas Raymond winds his way in. Try to feed that back in front, bounces off his skate. And now brought in by Lundquist. Down he goes to Raymond. Raymond, a centering pass that was missed on by Holtz. Raymond now on the loose puck. The two 17-year-olds out with the 18-year-old Hendrickson. In the slot, shot, rebound, bounces around in front. And Craig, when Thomas Montan talked to us before the tournament, he was concerned about goal scoring and part of that would be how would the two 17 year olds that being Alexander Holtz and Lucas Raymond how would they handle this competition and this tournament yeah and there's a big difference between 17 and 19 and the, despite the successes they've had uh, at the under 18 at the Holinka Gretzky tournament this is this is a real notch up and it's not just best on best in your age group it's best on best in three years of birth Dates. To Raymond, comes in and shoots and just fired on it. And now Raymond back with it. Back to Soderstrom. To Raymond. To the goal now he goes. Hoaglander, back to Soderstrom, across the hole for the shot. In comes Sandine, shoots from a sharp angle, that's why. Final minute now of regulation. Soderstrom shoots and Niftahov gloves that with Lucas Raymond skating to his eye line. Interesting without Hoaglander on Lucas Raymond. Yeah. The 17-year-old who's up on this top line here late in the game